Hey guys, get here and I'm back with more uh, Valhalla. Uh, last time I forget exactly what we did because I had a little bit of a hiatus where I didn't play for, uh, I don't know, maybe like a month I think it's been? Maybe? I hope not. That's a long time. Uh, but yeah, we're back. Um, so yeah, I had a little hiatus because we got a little new puppy. He's actually he's sitting right here next to me. I had to take care of him. Uh, so, plus I've been a little lazy. Anyways, um, we're back. Uh, I forget exactly what we were doing last. Um, I think we went through this, so there's an exclamation point there. So, we may not have gone through all of this. Uh, AM Township 64, uh, Hyper Rhythm Games, uh, Monster Girl Me, My One Behind the Library, and Monster Girl, uh, that, that, uh, this. Yeah, it looks like we went through that already. Let's have a look at this. Uh, Chirati becomes best-selling video game. Uh, the Waifu Revolution from the 2010s is no longer a laughing matter. What started as a trend of standardization of the art quality, a lot of people to do that. As a result of this craze, uh, of friend. Why the game is shipping nearly 90 million copies into the launch in March. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know. I remember that fried chicken thing, I think. Soccer popularity sinks as pro wrestling rises. Uh, once known as a gang of sports, I, th I think we went through this too. If not, it's here, because I can't really remember. So, you know. Uh, so just pause the video. Uh -huh. I, I usually won't say that, because I like reading the stuff, but you know. I'll say it there. Um, Dream person. Yeah, I think I remember that. Uh, Alright, let's uh, go to work, I think. Yeah. Wednesday, December 21st. Giving. Uh, okay. So another thing about okay, this is that I always forget the voices. Um, then again, that's like a weekly thing. Um, so I'm pretty sure I remember Dana's voice. Um, Ah, Jill! Good timing! Is it? You two always make me feel like I'm late. If it helps, the dog isn't coming until sometime later. Anyway, do you have something planned for Sunday? Uh, watch silly mega Christmas specials with a thousand grams of black fur in my lap? Why? I was thinking about holding a small mega Christmas party here this Sunday. You in? Sure, why not? Alright! Invite any client you're acquainted with. The more the merrier. You didn't bring your cat today. The raid stopped. Oh no, that's Jill. Uh, the raid stopped. Um, they found whatever, whoever they were looking for. Uh huh. Anyway, we better start working. Yeah, you better. All right, jukebox city. All right, so the last one is heart of the city. I remember how this stuff works. Boom, 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 boom. And here. Wait, what was the thing? I literally just read it in the, the, the last song. Okay, well, I forgot it. It said something about a city. I don't remember that much. Get it to. Um, but it was like one of the ones on the first pages. Uh, first page, that is. Uh, city that never. Heart of the city. Alright, there we go. And these ones go back to the beginning. Uh, you're probably hearing a lot of clicking right there because I have my mouse right next to my uh, microphone, which isn't the best idea, but you know, it works, you know, I guess. Um, Alright, I'm ready. Time to mix drinks and change lives. Welcome to Valha. Uh, um. I want a fluffy dream. May I see your ID, please? I don't have an ID because, um, I'm the ghost of Mega Christmas Past. Oh, I'll haunt you constantly unless you give me a fluffy dream. Uh, do you have money to pay for the drinks? Well, I... Do you? Yes, I, I have money. 
The girl asked for a fucking dream, but she's got to be crazy if she thinks she's getting alcohol so easily. Yeah. Uh. So don't put any carbatrine is in is what I'm thinking. Two, three. Uh, if I again, I have yet to confirm uh, or deny that carbatrine is alcohol, but I'm assuming since it's optional, it is so that you don't always so that all the drinks are alcoholic. Yeah. But I mean, I may just be entirely wrong, and it could just be like the salt of drinks. Um, all aged and mixed. There we go. Get, get, go, go, not get, get, go, go, get, get it going. Yeah. Uh, here you go. Wow, I actually got a drink. So, uh, who are you here to stalk, Miss Ghost of Mega Christmas Past? Stalk, all right. I'm a ghost. Uh, that guy, yeah. Which employee did you leave without a Mega Christmas gift, Gil? Without a Mega Christmas Gil? What? What did I read? Uh, which employee did you leave without a Mega Christmas Gil? What? I don't know. Something about that doesn't make sense to me. Jill, please. Uh, would have been funny if he reacted to that. Oh, I guess kill some employee? Sorry, kid, I'm not in the mood to humor you today unless you have some sort of ID. Here. Well, uh, you're in or so, I would gladly serve you a drink. But until then, this is no place for you. But I already got it. <laughs> but I already got a drink. A non alcoholic one. You didn't expect me to really give you a drink, right? Uh, so if you would please leave. I, I can't leave. Not after trying to so hard to even get here. <sighs> Alright, let's start from the beginning, Miss Norma. How'd you know my name? I saw you right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was kind of confused about that, too, because it wasn't like the, the usual, like, the name tag thing. Um, yeah. I saw your ID. It could have been a fake ID. I don't think you're stupid enough to make a fake ID that doesn't put you at 18 at the very least. You're very sharp, Miss Bar Bartender. You look like a nice girl, Norma. Why come to a bar like this? Uh, um... You seem like you're in a bad mood, Miss Bartender. Nah, she's just, she just like that all the time. Shut up. <sighs> Sorry if I've been harsh. But uh, these past last couple of days have been heavy. And having someone underage here reminds me of a certain incident from last week. What happened last week? I don't remember, because it wasn't last week for me. It was, uh, at the most, hopefully, a month ago. I mean, I said that already, so you know. Incident? Well... Don't change the subject, young lady. Uh, why did you, why did you come here? What do you care? I can do whatever I want. Unless it's illegal. In which case, anyone can, should, and probably will stop you. I just... Just wanted to be more wild, you know? Wild? My mom puts way too many expectations on my shoulders. I'm always... I've always been out to make sure I don't disappoint her. But it's never good enough. It's not good enough to have good grades. She also wants me to go out and take a college preparation course. And I'm tired. I don't want to do things for her anymore. So you came to a bar. Uh, maybe if I... I came back home smelling like, smelling like alcohol, she would leave me alone. If I'm not good enough for her, I might as well kill any hope she has in, she has in me. You remind me of this client I had a while ago. She, um, passed out in the street and my bro boss brought her here. Your attitude reminds me of how she got once drunk. Got once drunk? Got drunk once? That's another weird sort of way to put that sentence. Notice that a few times throughout this. Um, huh? Yeah, bitter about the pressure exerted on her. Uh, hers was workplace pressure, but you still remind me a lot of her. So, what of it? So, before you think, it, think anything else, calm down. I don't want you to go through what she went through. 
<laughs> I'm calm. So, let me get this straight. You came here to make your mother disappointed? Yes. Do you like alcohol? Actually, I think it's nasty. Then you're doing things wrong. What? If you're gonna disappoint your mom, at least do it with something you like. Like, become, <laughs> become a belly dancer because you want to be a belly dancer. Yeah. Uh, otherwise, you're just trying to hurt her for the sake of hurting her. Let's start with something. What do you like doing? I don't know. I've been so focused on trying to be good enough that I haven't been able to think about what I want to do. Uh, don't you think you should start there? Eh? What good is doing something just for the sake of hurting someone? If she gets disappointed in you over something like doing something you like doing, you have the right to protest. But if you're hurting her by hurting yourself over something you don't enjoy... Sounds silly, huh? Very. Go home. Do some self-discovery before you're before hurting your mom, would you? Or at the very least, humor her until you're old enough to move out. Yeah, you're right. Thanks, Miss Bartender. Call me Jill. Jill? Alright. I mean, Jill? Alright. Yeah, more excited. Uh, careful out there. In the end, you did humor her for a bit. Shut up. Oh, a doggy! Red Sheba! I forgot his voice, oh no! Uh, oh no. Oh boy, okay, um... Hello, little girl! No, that's not it. No, that's not it at all. Um... I... Again, the hiatus. Can't remember at all. It probably sounds stupid for those of you who are just watching this uh, in bulk after after the ball come out or something, but I just I can't remember it. I could always go back and look at the video, but who does that? Who watches their own videos? I mean, granted, like at least one of the views in all of my videos is from me because it looks sad to have zero views. So you know. Anyways, um, uh, okay, Rad Shiva. Um, hello, little girl. Oh, oh, poop. G and G A, how you doing? You're late. Miss me, Jay? You're too early. <laughs> ah, good to see you here. Boss, will you be any good around here? I'm right here. I know. Of course, there's been lots of time training him. Why do you think he didn't show up last week? Because how the heck would I know you'd bring a part-timer dog? Here, let me show you. Sit. Sir, yes, sir. Roll. Sir, yes, sir. Pa. Sir, yes, sir. Training, of course. He's only shouting sir, yes, sir, and not doing anything else, though. Oh, no. I never said I did a perfect job. Hmm? Is that a motorcycle? Oh, poop. Hey, is that my office? In the end, he's just a dog, I guess. Uh, ooh, who's this guy? Y yes? B bathroom. Oh, sorry, it's only for clients. Oh, um, promise me you'll buy something afterwards. It's that door over there. Who the heck are you? The other one. Sheesh. Said get out of my desk! For the world's ending! It was just a motorcycle. Then four they're the four riders then! <laughs> Those are horsemen, and it already stopped. Thanks. Don't mention it. Need to buy some now, right? Oh no, you don't have to. Sorry if it looked like I meant to inconvenience you. Nah, I'll, I'll order something. I need a rest anyways. What can I get you? A uh, piano woman would be nice. So, oh, okay, so he's a quiet speaker. Uh, sorry, didn't hear you. <laughs> I'll have a mo Mars Blast. Eh, sure. Mars Blast for a biker guy. I think he said piano woman first, though. So, do I give him the one he wants everybody to think he wants, or the one he actually wants? 
I'll just give him the one he actually wanted. I mean, by all means, if like I were actually in jail right now, I would have just made the Mars Blast because I would not know for sure if he said Piano Woman, but I have it in text, so, you know. I might as well do a little bit of uh, life breaking. I think I put six Adelaide. No, that's five Adelaide. Okay. Uh, five of those, five of those. Two powder, dirt, dirt. Uh, three flanner guide. One, two, three. Uh, okay. Uh, three karma tree. One, two, three. And all aged and mixed. Great. Here. You look happy. Shut up. Is that motorcycle out there yours, mister? Do I go with the obvious joke here? I mean, I could, and then that make me seem really, really like internet noobish, if that makes any sense. Like, like going for the low hanging fruit and acting like that's super funny, or I could not go for it and then, you know, just not have another joke. Um, so yeah. Call me Mario! Ah, uh, yeah, and yes, it's mine. Uh, okay, no. Um, sorry for the noise. Oh, don't worry, it's not like you stayed outside too long or anything. So, what do you work as, Mario? I live to paint the roads black with my wheels, leaving the trail of my engine sound wherever I go. Ah, I'm a rebel. Screw the red lights, screw the speed limit, screw the- Oh no! I uh, knocked my headphone jacket on my headphones. Alright, um, screw the helmet laws, the roads are mine and mine only, I am. Guys, it's, I'm going outside with the dog, we'll advertise the bar. Hello, doggy. Hello, shady guy. Shady. I'll be back before long, don't worry. Alright. Careful. Who was she? Oh, she's my boss. She was cute. Er, not that you're not cute. Uh, it's not like I'm into girls either. Not that there's anything wrong with that, I just... So where do you work, Mario? I told you, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a rebel. I Rebels can't maintain those bikes for, long, for too long. What's your day job? I'm a delivery boy. That's really appropriate, I guess. What do you deliver? I'm from a courier company, so it's kind of like mail, I guess. I'm always around the city, and I know, and I know it like the palm of my hand. Sure, I might not remember every building, but I can remember every inter intersection and every street. That's nice. I still can't take detours without without feeling totally lost. Try guiding yourself with the help of landmarks. Around here, the Saber Station's oh, oh, sorry, the Saber Station's antenna is a good reference. Or, I mean, uh, what do I care? Uh, fix that yourself, b b ditch. Uh, do you want anything else, Mario? I guess a moon blast would be nice. Moon blast? Yeah, gut punch. Yeah, that one. Again, you asked for a gut punch, but I'm pretty sure you asked for a moon blast first. Yeah, I'll give you a moon blast, man. I mean, I mean, a gut punch. It's, it's gonna go right into your gut. With my fist, that is. And then, then it'll be broken. Not not my fist, the, the, the gut. Yeah. <laughs> um, alright. On the rocks and landed. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, five. That wasn't five seconds. Not, not five of my seconds, anyways. Alright, here. Um, <laughs> this is good. It's a moon blast. No, I... No, never mind. Say, Mario, why do you try so hard to keep up that tough guy image? It isn't working. Maybe when you arrived and had to go to the bathroom, but after that you just look cute. Cute. 
so why do it? Beggars are supposed to be scary, right? Rubbles that cause trouble and ride free from society's ties. If we applied that brand of logic here, I should be wearing one third of my clothes and lighting drinks on fire. I guess. You can do whatever you want and dress, however, and dress however you want. It's just that you look like you're trying so hard. Like, you don't really enjoy that. It's not a lie. Who says you can't dress as a biker and still be a nice kid? Yeah, but other bikers. That sounded like something someone in high school would say. Uh, it's just advice. Don't take it too personally. No, you're right. I don't have to be that way. Unless you want to. I ain't stopping you there. Yeah, but I don't. It's tiring and I don't feel good. If you want, you can try to stay quiet. You were pretty intimidating when you did that. I see. Do you have another drink or did you have too many already? <laughs> I can handle another one. Give me a friend give me a friend weaver. Sure. He actually asked for a friend weaver instead of just something manly. Good for him. Yeah. Alright, Fringe Viveru. Uh, one adult died and nine carbitrine. It's a lot of alcohol. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, all aged and mixed. There we go, there was our Fringe Viveru. Alright, here. Yep, that's the one. Thanks. Say, that guy over there. Jill, what's up with him? Are you dating him? No. Is he seeing? Oh! Is he seeing anyone? Not as far as I know. Do you think he. He. No, n never mind. I said nothing. <laughs> Thank you for everything. Please come again. Ah, Jill. You heartbreak. <laughs> you heartbreaking uh, screwboy. Eh, what? None. I'll be taking my break now, Jill. Okay, careful. Alright, we are here. And we're at a good time here. Um, I could probably get one more client in, but, you know, I'd rather not make this too long. So I'm just gonna save and, uh, we're done. So, in the next episode, I guess we're gonna see the rest of the clients for the night for the night. I think I've been too close to my mic this whole time. That's not good. Um, I, I've been standing like I was last time and I've also had to keep an eye on my little puppy. Uh, didn't mention his name. He named him uh, Jordo because I'm uh, Jojo Trash. Anyways, um, yeah. So next time we're going to do what I said we were going to do what then before. So I'll see you guys at that appointed time. Oh no, hold on, hold on, hold on, it's about to stop, it's, it's about to stop, my, my, my hotkey wasn't working, stop, hold on, stop, oh no, oh no, this is so unprofessional, oh no.